Hi there, myself Abhilash. I am running an Excel blog by name excel2excel.com and in this video uh, I am going to show you how to prepare uh, a data validation icon. Okay, uh, let me show you here. See, you have uh, uh, when, whenever you prepare data validation uh, list, okay. Uh, you it is very difficult for you to identify where exactly the data validation list is uh, uh, prepared like where uh, which cell has the data validation right so it now uh, you can actually assign uh, an icon something like this see it is actually showing like you can identify now right see uh, my cursor is here but still you can identify these cells have uh, a list like drop down list right so if I keep it here see I can directly go to that particular cell and I can use the drop down I, I can use uh, the drop down list right whichever whichever I want I can use it right so how to prepare this we know we all know like how to prepare data validation uh, using Excel right let me show you once again for you let me uh, demonstrate if you go to data okay you have uh, a data validation when you click on it okay uh, you have uh, an option called list here hello any value here you select list okay here you will get source that means you need to click on this to select the source source in the sense like what you need to uh, what you need in a drop-down list okay what are the items that you require to see in a drop down list right when you click here i have uh, the data ready for me if uh, you are doing it for the first time make sure uh, uh, you create your data before you proceed okay let me select this yeah see i have a country here okay so just click on this click okay that's all see see uh, can you identify where exactly uh, you have uh, prepared data validation no right so it is actually here how I how uh, I identified it is difficult for anybody it is difficult to identify unless you go and activate that cell it is difficult see if I go here there is no data validation list right similarly if I go here I have a data validation which I have created now right so uh, same uh, similarly uh, okay let me not prepare the other one uh, let me show you how to uh, do this uh, uh, icon right so here if you go to developer tab uh, I think uh, it is not required to uh, explain where developer tab is all right if you go to insert you have form controls okay just uh, uh, select the combo button okay which is this one just click on that and okay I'm sorry this is so big okay you need to format it accordingly yeah so this cell has data validation right so I need to right click okay give escape and format it the way it looks right okay right click escape so that you can edit this yeah so I have to place it exactly right see unless you activate this it will not be uh, uh, the data uh, the drop down is not uh, visible okay that's it uh, so with this uh, you have the data validation icon visible all the time right okay so this is how you can uh, uh, prepare a, a drop down list which is visible and make sure you adjust the column width so that it fits into one particular cell okay so when you click on the active cell, when you go to the drop down list cell when you activate that cell uh, the drop down will automatically uh, uh, pops up for you okay that means uh, uh, 
uh, the dummy one the dummy uh, drop down list which you have prepared will be uh, hidden behind the uh, real drop down list okay that's all uh, from my end uh, if you like this video please share it on your social networking sites and help your your friends and who are really in need and uh, uh, thanks for watching all my videos okay keep watching my videos and uh, please do uh, register if you have not registered so that you will get all the updates from excel to excel.com okay that's all from my end see you bye bye